moving our focus to the climate issue here in Korea. With unstable weather, the price of apples has skyrocketed this year. This change in climate is also set to affect apple harvest in the long term. Our An Songjin went out to uh, how farms are looking to adapt. Apples in South Korea are the most expensive in the world. According to Nambeo, an online database which measures consumer prices, apples in South Korea are about six U.S. dollars 82 cents a kilo, which is much higher than the price of apples in the U.S. or Japan. With the sudden change in the temperature, apple flowers died out before blossoming, leading to a drop in the amount of apples harvested last year and a surge in apple prices. Due to climate change, temperatures have been rising, and according to the Environment Ministry, South Korea has seen a temperature rise of 1.6 degrees compared to 110 years ago. This is higher than the world average temperature rise of 1.09 degrees. As a result, the most suitable environment for growing apples has been moving northward up the peninsula from the southern provinces. Farms have been adapting to this change by integrating technology. This is one of the country's first smart farms located in Andong, Gyeongsangbuk-do province. Funded by the Agricultural Ministry, it uses ICT tools and AI technology to monitor individual farms and prevent damage to apples from pests. Using my phone app, I can easily control the farm's environment. With the AI camera, I get to monitor the growth of apples, detect pests and prevent frost. These farms also have their own smart irrigation and fertilization system which controls the amount of water used. The control center gathers weather data such as humidity and land temperature and tracks the plants and analyzes them for any issues over time. We provide farms with the necessary data. However, it's the individual farms that make the final decision on what to do. It's important that we continue to expose the rural population to the concept of smart farming. The government is also addressing the change in harvesting conditions for apples by developing new apple varieties. We're working on cultivating different varieties of apples, such as those with good coloring, green and yellow apple varieties, and those apples that can grow well despite temperature changes during the flowering season. To maintain efficient productivity, harvesting apples with machines and automation will become more common. Land that is suitable to grow apples is diminishing, but smart farms like these allow apples to be harvested despite the changing environment. Now, this smart farm, empty at the moment, is expecting to see flowers blossom by the end of April and apples to be harvested between October and November. An Songjin, Arirang News, Andong.